Good morning, my dear friends. Praise the Lord, my dear friends. I thank God for all of you. Thank God for the gift of life, the gift of the Holy Ghost, and the gift of you, my dear friends. This wonderful morning, we are thanking God for his goodness. And remember, the theme in January has been that I'm rebuilding. And then, my dear friends, I'm saying, issue a king's decree. Issue a king's decree. At times, you forget who we are. At times, you forget what power we possess. At times you think that, and this is the issue that at times we have, is we think that we don't have the power to speak a word and it comes to pass. At times you forget that we are a royal priesthood. You know, we forget that we are royalty. And being royalty means that we have the power to speak and establish a decree. And there's a rebuilding in your life that you, my dear friends, can decide. There's a rebuilding that can commence and should commence your life that you determine. There's a rebuilding, my dear friends, that you will establish yourself by your own words, by your own mouth. What is Victor saying this morning? I'm saying in Ezra chapter 5, verse 13, it says, But, begins by but, in the first year of Cyrus, the king of Babylon, the same king Cyrus made a decree to build this house of God. He made a decree to build this house of God. Now, of course, I'm saying it begins with but because if you read the previous text, you get the context. But it says that Cyrus, the king of Babylon, the same king Cyrus, made a decree to build this house. Meaning that there was a king's decree to build that which was destroyed. This decree you hear is coming from a human being. You have the power, my dear friends, to speak over your life and make a king's decree this morning. Make a decree as a royal child of God that I make a decree that a rebuilding begins in, in my life. A reestablishment begins in my life. A repositioning begins in my life. That in the name of just this morning, I declare that there's a rebuilding that must take place. A decree. But it doesn't matter what has happened. But, the Bible says, but in the first year of Cyrus, but in this first month of this year, you make a kingly decree and declare the rebuilding you want over your life. I want to touch and agree with you this morning on the rebuilding that the Lord should do in your life. How I thank you and I bless you, Almighty Father, King of kings and Lord of lords. The Lord, you are able to do above and beyond what you thought of or imagined. I pray this morning, Father, may your Holy Ghost release supernatural power through us. The Lord, we may speak a kingly decree. I touch and agree with all of your sons and daughters this morning. The Lord, they're rebuilding their desire in the area they want, Lord, their marriages, their finances, their health, their children, their careers, Lord, their walk with you, whatever it is, Lord, they need a rebuilding. Today, by the power that rose Christ from, from the dead, may that decree be established in Jesus' name. I thank you, Father, and I bless you. In Jesus' name, pray thanksgiving. Amen. My dear friends, stay blessed. See you again next time, same time.